Hey guys, I'm Ryan Wright. And I'm Samantha Ashley Fells. Samantha is finally back on the channel. Hi, it's been guys. a very long time. She was getting into the wrong industry for a while. No, uh, it no, was no. Pretty no. terrible. You could catch her videos on certain websites. Don't believe him. Please do not search that. We're gonna check out the trailer today for Masterminds. Official oh. trailer number one, Kristen Wiig, Zach Galifianakis, dream team coming together. Ha, huh, dream team coming together. Just hit play. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My name is David Gant. I always felt I was destined for a life of adventure. It didn't quite pan out that way until I met Miss Kelly Campbell. Don't speak, even whisper. What would you do with a million dollars? Probably start my own business. Maybe be a bounty hunter. Nice. We don't put cap. Oh, 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 David, let me see. Oh, God. I think that bullet just went straight between your cheeks. Yeah, it feels like it just grazed my biscuits right there in between. Huh. <laughs> tells me you all work together over at Lumix. That strikes me as an incredible opportunity. You talk about robbing a bike? How hard can it be? You load up a truck, and you drive away. <laughs> Police are calling it one of the largest cash heists ever. Oh. Oh. Authorities are I'm gonna rub a bank. This man. <laughs> this is a disguise. How many for you? Sixteen dollars seventy-eight cents. Well, it looks like if Jesus and Cat had a baby. <laughs> Seventeen million missing. Seventeen. Oh. I know you're just two good men doing a difficult job. <laughs> <laughs> David Gamp from the team. We can't do this. This is wrong. So, who y'all want me to kill? Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> not now, not in front of. Is it one of them? No. Please go upstairs right now. See y'all in a little bit. Oh. see these turkeys go out and earn 17 million dollars mean-spirited comedy indeed i wonder how much of that is actually true was this actually a story that was kind of funny mm -hmm. or did they just take a true story and turn it into a comedy i mean it could have been either it looks pretty funny no matter what but you know i do need to know things like this to see how funny it really is you know like based off truth Hold on, I'm gonna go murder that family outside for making too they're, much noise. They're distracting me. They're distracting me too. How dare they? I haven't murdered a family in a long time. I mean, you've gone this long. Why, why, why start again? Veronica would be very upset to have to bail you out. Yeah. Yeah, you can just get bailed out for murdering a family. <laughs> this is an awesome cast, okay? Like, it's produced by one of the dudes who produced, um, We're the Millers. Ah, uh, it totally had that feel, the really funny and like, Kind of mean-spirited kind of comedy. Yes. I, I do enjoy a good mean-spirited kind of film. And one character that I'm actually drawn to is Owen Wilson. Because Owen Wilson is someone who is normally like the laid-back nice dude. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like he can be kind of a cocky dick sometimes. But he he's going for a much more mean-spirited kind of humor in this. Yeah. And I'm interested in seeing Will, uh, Owen Wilson's like more dark kind of comedy. He looks like a genuine jackass in this. Yeah. Like yeah. a sleazy jackass. I know. Kind of reminds me of myself. Wow. Have you seen Owen Wilson says wow? Have you guys seen that video? Mm. Wow. What? Owen Wilson says wow like in almost every single movie he does. Oh. And he says it like that. Wow. <laughs> and Kristen Wiig is amazing. Just, I think, always. She's hilarious. She looks, looks pretty like, hot. She does look really hot. Has she been working out? Um, well, she was already thin. And I thin mean, equates and to good looking in Hollywood. But, like, she looked especially hot. But they oh, yeah, also no. had the lollipop moment. Mm, yeah, yeah. Yeah. 
I like seeing that lollipop go in Kristen Wiig's mouth. I know, I'm sure yeah. most guys did. Yeah, yeah, and Zach Galifianakis, hairy ass motherfucker. He's he, awesome. He is awesome. Yeah, I really do enjoy watching him in films. He's one of those comedians who's just not afraid to really go all out and commit to the bits. Like when he was laughing, he was really <laughs> turning red in the face doing that. He and just goes all out, like he goes balls to the wall. Balls to the wall, balls deep, balls to the mouth. Whatever you want to say about balls, that's what Zach Galifianakis does. Or just balls to the wall. I'm just saying. You make me want to murder that family. And one thing about this film that I'm seeing a lot of is slapstick. And the slapstick looks like it's pulled off well. Like good physical comedy is well, hard I mean, to Zach come across. Well, I mean, Zach Galifianakis is such a slapstick comedian. But, like, you know, he just commits to it. And he creates honesty in that. And I think that's what makes it hilarious. So yeah. it's not stupid slapstick. It ends up being pretty actually funny in my opinion. Well, you said that point really well. Thank you. I'm proud of you. Thank you very much. Anyway, guys, thanks for tuning in to The Real Rejects. Hell if you're yeah. new to the channel, you can subscribe to this awesome YouTube channel, this empire. You can subscribe to it. And you can check out Samantha's channel. Please do, because, you know, if you think he's cool, I'm way cooler. Yeah. There was this thing we used to talk about with Samantha on the channel no. many months ago. No. It's about people defecating on her chest. No! Not okay. We're not bringing that back. I think we should bring it back. I thought we moved on from this. Uh, I think Facebook posts and tweets. No, we, <laughs> we had Don't do it. That'd be fucked up. <laughs> Don't do it. And you can follow us on Facebook, Instagram, <laughs> Twitter, and Vine, where if we get enough followers, taking over the we world. can get more product placement. That's right, Samantha. I've already gotten some product placement. Now, so I want to make more money. Money is the root of all happiness. We're just telling that to a couple of no. friends. And no, money, it's not. yes, it is. If no, money, money solves so many problems. Children, don't listen to him. Money is not happiness. Okay. It will take you to bad places. I can give you an example of everything. Right now, I could hire someone, a hitman, to fucking take care of that family for us. If I had more money, hence you more could still go placement. to jail for that though. Hence more product placement? I need more product placement to afford the money to get Hitman. Well, why aren't we product placing something now? I want to product place something. You can't just product place something and expect money. You gotta get them to offer it to you. What if I product place this glass? This nice... Do you even know what kind of glass that is? It is a very cool glass. See, this is why I mean, this, nice... this is why we don't make money. <laughs> this is why we don't make money. Well, you know what? I'm trying. Yeah, we'll try harder. You're drinking my water. You drank my water. Sorry. I was really in the moment. <laughs> Welcome to the uncomfortable world again. <laughs>